it's a long due request from the subscribers to discuss about definition of Laplace transform, function of class A, and the theorem about existence of Laplace transform. Let's see the definition of Laplace transform. Laplace transform of Ft denoted as Fs equals to integration 0 to infinity e power minus st ft dt where ft is a real valued function defined over the interval minus infinity to infinity such that ft equals to 0 for all t less than 0. And the parameter S is a real or complex number. Now let's see function of class A. A function Ft is said to be of class A if 1. It is sectionally continuous over every finite interval in the range t theta equals to 0. Number 2. Ft is of exponential order as t tends to infinity. Now let's see the theorem about existence of Laplace transform. If Ft is a function of class A, then Laplace transform of Ft exists. The above theorem is sufficient but not necessary. Here we see one example that the above theorem is sufficient but not necessary. Sometimes it comes in the exam in this way. Show that Laplace transform of the function ft equals to t to the power n where n less than 0 greater than minus 1 exists and is not a function of class A. Let us find the Laplace transform of t power n according to the definition Following the definition, let us put ft as t power n. Let us substitute st as u, then as dt is du. dt equal du by s. Now let us substitute here e power minus st is e power minus u and t power n is u by s power n and dt is du by s. Now here s power n and this s becomes s power n plus 1 and it is out of the integration and we have the integration 0 to infinity e power minus u u power we can write this n as n plus 1 minus 1 to follow the gamma distribution so we are getting the numerator as gamma n plus 1 and the denominator as s power n plus 1 here n plus 1 always greater than 0 so we see that laplace transform of t power n exists Now here you see that the function ft equal t power n is not sectionally continuous 
in every finite interval of range for t greater equals to 0. And f t is not continuous at t equals to 0. Therefore, f t is not a function of class A.